Hello everyone, Craig from Flying Wheels in Danville, New Hampshire. I am in a 2017 Mazda 3 and we just did a synthetic oil change and we are going to be resetting that wrench light right there. If this video is at all helpful, do me a favor and give me a thumbs up so other people get to see this video as well. And don't forget to subscribe for more car videos. All right, so this vehicle is equipped with push to start. It's the same uh, same way of doing it with the push to start or key. We're going to turn it to position two. So position two of the key is one, two turns without starting the engine. Uh, with start to stop, we keep our foot off the brake and we push it twice. You'll see everything lighting up. Here is your scroll and select. So we're going to go over to apps, applications. So we're going to push to the left to get to applications. And select is just push down. You'll see vehicle status monitor. So we're going to turn it two clicks down to vehicle status monitor and push enter on that knob. Scroll down to maintenance, push enter again, and you'll see oil change down at the bottom. So here I am again turning it two turns and then select. Here we'll go to oil life reset. Are you sure you want to reset your oil? Reset. And there we go. You'll see 7,500 miles on the oil change interval. That is how you reset the maintenance required light on a Mazda 3. Again, please give a thumbs up for this video so other people get to see it. And don't forget to subscribe for more car stuff. Thank you, everyone. Bye-bye.